Okay guys, so I saw this product on Facebook. It's been going a little viral lately and I decided to get it and give it a try. I've only tried it in my car so obviously I don't know how well it works. It is by Ardell. It is the Stroke a Brow um, Feathering Pen and I have it in the color Medium Brown which I think might be a little too light for me but no big deal. Um, it was the darkest color they had because I guess everybody saw it and decided that they needed to give it a try. <clears throat> so this is what it looks like in the packaging. And then it's got this super, super fine tip. And basically you just take it and it kind of mimics the way microblading works on your, la on your eyebrows. So we're going to give this a shot and see how good it will work. And I have a whole lot of little bald spots in my eyebrows. So for me, this is going to be a little extra hard because I have to fill this in and kind of make it look natural. Not just add to it, but completely create a brow in some places. And like I've told y'all several times, uh, due to that, brows have never been my strong point because I've never had any to really work with. But we're just going to sweep this on in here and see how natural we can get it to look. And I think that's definitely a big difference. Let's just zoom it in. So you can see, it really looks like little hairs. I'm gonna go through the spoolie in a minute, but if you just compare this brow with all my bald spots to this one with the feathering pin, you can see a solid difference. And I'm in the middle of, ooh, it just zoomed in on its own. Look at that camera go. Um, I'm in the middle of doing my makeup, so. Looking a little rough right now. I'm going to go ahead and zoom y'all in just a little bit so that you can see what I'm doing a little better. On this side, we're just going to try to do the same thing. And this side actually arches a little easier because as luck would have it, my bald spot is right where my arch needs to go on this eye. So it's a little easier to make this one look a bit more natural. And I think what might work best with this is if you take a pencil and kind of outline where you want it to go and then just fill in with this. But for this video, I just wanted to use only this on my brows so y'all could see how well it works on its own. And this is a $10 product. I'm sure you can get it online. I picked mine up at Sally's. If you don't have one of those, it's a beauty supply store. Pretty great. I think you can probably get a discount too if you have one of their kind of like pro cards. You don't have to be a cosmetologist to get that. It's just like a yearly $5, $10 fee or something. Okay. So we're going to call this good on the eyebrows and now we're just going to get a spoolie through there to kind of calm this down a little bit. And I'm using this. It's got a really nice spoolie on it and it's so cute. Like even if you hated this pencil, if you got it in BoxyCharm, it is just adorable. I've never seen any kind of pencil this cute. And when you brush it through, it kind of blends it in almost, it looks like. And I'm probably going to have to go in and touch up a couple of spots real quick. But this did help to kind of control the, the crazy look it had going for a second there. So let me just touch this little area up. I'm thinking maybe the trick is to wait until it's all the way dry to use that 
boy. But <clears throat> I have to say, um, I definitely like this. This is a hit for me. Um, I think this is a good product to get if you are not into microblading. It's like, I don't want to pay for it and I don't want someone cutting on my eyebrows. So this would be much better in my opinion. I would rather have it. Yes, I know my eyebrows are a little wonky. They just grow different. There's nothing I can do about that. But um, I hope you all liked it. This is definitely a product that I would recommend to everybody. And uh, I'll see you all later. Bye, guys.